Good morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog. So if you like this video, please come back tomorrow. Do I look familiar from yesterday's vlog sign off? Um, I just want to say good morning. I've been having a hard morning already, um, but I'm going to eat a plate of chips for breakfast and uh, turn on some of my dad's favorite movies, which I know we've done in the years past. Um, I am going to obviously edit the vlog and do some work today, but it'll be nice to have on in the background, but I'm going to start with Forrest Gump. This is a very bad treat of mine I'm going to eat. <laughs> Look at this tired pup. I realized not everybody might have watched yesterday's vlog or known this about us. This could be the very first vlog that you're ever watching from the Brookhart Project. Um, but just so you're aware, today is the anniversary of my dad passing away eight years ago from melanoma cancer. So on this day every year, we like to eat his favorite foods and watch his favorite movies, do his favorite things. Um, just honor him extra every single day. We talk and think and our actions are, you know, are totally molded by him and every everything that he did for us and so much of me is him like guys if you saw a picture of me like no makeup like it's truly my dad <laughs> um but also so much more of me too so today is extra heavy but we always have smiles on our faces because we go out of our way to honor him so it's always like a rough day so Thank you for coming along. I don't know what we're gonna do tonight. Um, Peter actually had to work, and so <clears throat> I'm by myself, so it's kind of a little heavier today, but I'm kind of just rambling. I know that, I know that we'll have um, a good day remembering him, and yeah, thanks for keeping me company while I am home alone today. Second movie of the day is Toy Story 3. My dad used to watch this, like, we had it recorded, and he'd watch it over and over again. So I don't know if I've talked about this on here, but Eve has been by my side constantly. She would have never in a million years done this before, and that was one of the telltale signs for Peter that I was, that the, that the transfer had worked. It was just crazy, like... Who is this doggy? I, I love it. I really hope it stays even after. But oh my goodness. She's just like gone from energy 24 7 to like a protective little pup. Okay, so I watched Signs. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. Um, the Secretariat is now on. And more importantly, the boy is home. The boy is home. And I got. A can of Pepsi for Sarah. And a Dr. Pepper for yourself. That's a secret. Here's our Amy's pizza. I already started eating. And then that's the Sweet Earth one. Delicious. This is the first time we were just talking. Oh, so we're going to Magic Kingdom, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> but we were just talking about it's the first time we've come to the Magic Kingdom for, for like enjoyable play. What's the right way to say it? For a good time that's not running. Like, since we found out Sarah was leisure. pregnant. For leisure. Um, just for plan. Since we found out our good news. And we're here to do a bunch of Sarah's dad's favorite things. Yeah, and, and things the, that we like to do with dad. So we got three goals and we're missing we missed one. We got a multi-experience app, so I might try and grab another fast pass for a different one. I don't know. We'll figure it so out. So we're doing but... Pirates because that's his favorite. Yes. We're doing, I almost said Autotopia. <laughs> Tomorrowland Speedway because 
I've always been a fan and my dad, me and my dad would always go on it together. Because no one else wanted to go on the ride <laughs> besides Sarah, so she would, he would always go on with Sarah. And then Buzz Lightyear. The very first time Peter got Galactic Hero was with my dad. My dad is so competitive and his thing wasn't working. <laughs> but then the whole and time he would, stuck. and we got stuck. So the whole time it was his goal then to get me to Galactic Hero. Yeah. So like first he wanted to beat Peter. And then, then he realized he couldn't. couldn't. <laughs> and so then he helped Peter get Galactic Hero for the first time. So, so that's the one we might miss, but we might be able to sneak on because it's yeah. not like the, the highest demand. Yeah. Like, but it's busy. Yeah. It's busy. Um, one, Main Street. Beautiful. Two, when was the last... Oh, did they? I was gonna say, when was the last time you saw Main Street packed at the halfway point? We're gonna have to cut through the Emporium to get to our pirates. Look at you with your old Disney World outfit. Rockin', rockin', rollin', rockin', rollin', rollin', rockin'. It smells so delicious. I feel like we're on, like, volume 11. Or we're amped volume 11. We're amped. We're, I feel like we're amped. We're amped? Yeah. Oh, I thought you said we're ants. Poking a little fun because I for sure thought maybe there's no line because everyone's gonna be scared. Yeah. Oh my god, it's a five minute wait. <laughs> Should we go on it? Yeah. Let's go on it. So I thought OSHA would be all over this today, but I don't know if you saw, but when you're watching this, we'll say yesterday, um, a boat went sunk today at the Jungle Cruise. So we're gonna go on it. I thought it would be close. I thought it would be close, but it's not. Underwater was my last boat. <laughs> <laughs> That's all beneath me now. Tour guide, your dance instructor, your Jedi master, and most importantly, if you don't laugh at my jokes, I will be your swimming instructor. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't know how to swim. Sandstone rock formation, a lot of people take it for granted, but I personally think it's one of our boulder attractions. I really think it rocks. The one, the only, and the wonder. Cambodia, please try to keep up. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. But he is just joking. I was like, oh no. Oh, but he's not, he's not joking, I'm not joking, I'm not joking, I'm not joking. He's actually got quite a deal for you folks today. Yeah. Two of his heads for one of yours. All right, everyone, you have been outstanding here on this dock today. All right, I think because of the circumstances of today. Oh, fireworks. Peter laughed that entire <laughs> cruise. It was just so funny. I don't think she was going to. So there's a classic line in the beginning that if you don't laugh, she will be your, your swimming Seven instructor. Shocker. And I don't think she was going to say it, but I was like. <laughs> and she said it, and it was just so funny because of what happened today. Oh. We yeah, literally was, got here. Wait, oh, I forgot to tell you. Guys. That that's still true to our night dedicated to my dad because my dad was keen on going on Jungle Cruise at night. Yes. That was always our tradition. Yes. My dad loved Jungle Cruise yes. at night. So that was perfect. And if we may save this whole night considering we, we got here with only an hour and 15 minutes left of park time. But our fast pass got turned into a rehab for pirates. But if the wait's not long, we won't need a fast pass. Let's walk on. Okay, now this ride is my dad's absolute favorite. Captain Jack Sparrow, show this of your miserable curve. <laughs> 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 You're clucking. The gentlemen want the rum. Pirates because we got stuck in like the farthest point ever. We were in front of the, the, the 
the, the doggy. The chip, and, the, uh, not quartet, what are they called? Four a trio of a trio. trespassers. A trio, the singing trio of pirates. Do you know what a trio of trespassers is from? Put it in the I don't even know, let me think about it. Oh, look at all the Christmas stuff and the millions of plates and cups that we <laughs> were so scared they were going to be sold out. Beyond, like, troubled by that. We snuck in here for warmth and Christmas smells on the way to tomorrow. Like, we have 30 minutes to get some stuff done. That's the second time in a row I've been on that and have, haven't gotten Galactic Hero. Well, we're about to go on Carlin Speedway for our last night of the ride and then a stroll through Fantasyland. Yes. And I'm going to A nice drive. stroll. And maybe if there's absolutely zero line, we hop on teacups. Oh gosh. Can well, I go on teacups? I'm not even convinced you can go on Speedway. We might have to drive it just smooth. And teacups, we could teacups. Look at that. I think I want to go on teacups. My dad Dumbo. My dad would not go on teacups because Dumbo. he did not like he could he get too dizzy. He Dumbo. would never he would always Dumbo. watch his time. Dumbo, Dumbo, Dumbo. Okay. I'm a rule follower. You are. <laughs> I bet you we could. I think we could as long as we didn't Especially go. Especially since like Bing Bang Chris like crashing super around. Super cozy right now. Yeah. But instead we'll just get more yeah. cruising time. Yeah, we'll go on Dumbo. We're going on Dad's favorite color, blue. So we're going to skip Big Top Souvenirs. Yes. Today we're going to check out the carpet eventually, where on the street is. It's wood now. No, it's like office gray. I thought gross. it was fake wood. No. Ugh. Yeah, it's like airport carpet. Ugh. Instead of like bottom of a tent carpet. Themed carpet. Bienvenido. We're going to try to get on Winnie the Pooh. Honestly. No correlation to my dad, except making the very most of every minute right. you have he, in the park. He would definitely want us to speed walk safely directly to <laughs> a ride with four minutes left in park operating hours yeah. to get on because it's hopefully a short line. And then we will, after park close, Peru, <laughs> Fantasyland. Oh yeah, we made it. We are in the queue and it looks like a very, very, very short queue. So that's five attractions in an hour and ten minutes. Yeah, we picked one. This is secretly my second favorite attraction in Magic Kingdom. It's a good one. If you ask me, he'll never reach that dream. I have never noticed this before, but this Winnie the Pooh is us in real life. <laughs> and Eve. And Eve, all at the same time. Like constantly on a little adventure, constantly hungry. We're practically in the park by ourselves right now, and it's so magical, and the Kiss Goodnight's going on. We haven't been here at this time in a long time. Are you so happy? <laughs> I love you. I love you too, I gotta sneeze. <laughs> <laughs> Closing out the night. <laughs> it's I want almost... some footwork. <laughs> um I think one of my my dad's the biggest things would be to look up while you're at Disney and look at all the details. He'd always tell us, slow down, take it in. So if you're Disney, 
slow down. Take it, take it in. And when you get home, Tabasco sauce on chips. Even <laughs> when you're full, you gotta do it for Mr. Ryan. <laughs> I tell you, go to bus stop 27 in front of Magic Kingdom. It wasn't even listed in the big menu yeah. that we it could see, but I was like, let's just go here. see it if it's there. And we saw, I saw as we were walking towards it, a bus said, ticket and transportation center. Huge game changer. It took us about four minutes to get here and we walked right on the bus. It's cold tonight, guys. Yeah. Sarah does need to take it easier. Yeah. We got to sit in a warm Toast seat. To bust. Right away. Yeah, game changer. Huge. Just like no weight at all. And vacation experiences, feeling like we're on a bus. Yeah, close my eyes, my dad's there. Just a little Frozen 2 action before. Ah! Hey! Before bed. The 27th. Stress is caused by being here, but wanting to be there. My like heart toll. Forget your stress. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> this is what happens when you lay down and Eve licks your face for five minutes on the couch. It's good to be home. It is good to be home. Thanks for being so nice about our hearts lately. Good night. Good night. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>